Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about calculus applications and concepts. Now, when it comes to the calculus, really, the applications are where it's most important because you get to use it in real life, or depending on the areas of uh, profession that you're going into. Now, the two basic ideas behind calculus that really drives the course are that of the derivative and that of the integral. Now let's talk about the derivative first. Now the def definition of derivative is the in instantaneous rate of change. So when it comes to applications of the calculus involving derivative, and within the context of the problem, they really have to explain to you that to find the instantaneous rate of change or simply the rate of change at a particular moment in time, or depending on the situation, they may ask you to f give you code words for you to find the derivative. So for example, one application is that of the speed function. Speed function is given as s of t. They may ask you to find the velocity of that function. The velocity is known as v of t, but it's actually the derivative of the speed function. So that's where the derivative comes in. Also, acceleration. Acceleration is denoted by a of t, but it's actually the derivative of the velocity function. So the rate of change of velocity. Now, when it comes to finding the integral, just a couple of things to help you in terms of applications. You may be asked to find the average value of an interval of a particular function, and that involves finding the integral. But also, throughout calculus, you'll be asked to find the area of an object as well as the volume of an object, and all of those things involve finding the integral. So, as you can tell, calculus is a very applicable field. It all depends on what the context is. So, I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's an oh-so-brief introduction on calculus applications and concepts.